we go off turn number four. They're showing 30 laps, so I guess we're gonna go 30 tonight. Here we go. Oh, that 16 car tried to sneak in there. He knows it's going to, and Tyson Blood takes the early lead. Serving into second. Oh, Tyson spins from the lead. Chaos in turn three. A green from our flagman, are we? Yes, we are. Here we go, back on the way. We'll keep an eyeball out this time. That 16 gets away, it's going to be tough. But look at Lane Zerbin, like you said, he was coming on. Well, there he is in second. And only about two or three car difference between him and the 16 car. Craig Moore, who's been on fire this month, he's got a battle. His hands full for third. He's up to third. And Devin Reed looking strong early on in the 58 car with Brad Purdy coming into fifth. Keep an eye on that 54 in. He's up to about the fifth spot right now. Just needs the right spot. He'll squeeze in the middle, trying to make it three wide off turn two, and something's got to give, and it's more that gives a little bit. Well, that'll move Trencher up to the third spot. The four-time champion on the move. Does he have enough time? Does he even have enough? Does anybody have anything for the 16 car? That's the question. But watch the second row. Here we go, back underway. Oh, a little bit of a slide jump. The 81 comes back. Trencher goes up. 81 on the move. He'll go wide. That should bring Trencher back in the pick. Trouble again. Oh, my. Turns four, the popular spot. Sorensen. They didn't even make it to turn four. Sorensen, Miner, and Smith. Yep, you got him. Three laps still remaining. Oh, Trencher likes those cautions and puts him up to second. Look at him, traffic jam back there. 81 on back. Look at that. Three wide once again in turns three and four. Goodness. Traffic is heavy as a Friday night in Seattle, I'll tell you. Look at Gray Ferrando. Look at a try four wide, but that ain't going to work. Gray Ferrando on that V13 trying to find a way around to get up there and be competitive with him. He'll dig low. And 58 is making it. Devin Reed is not going to give it too easy to him, for sure. Got to watch those tires out there. If Greg Ferrando can get by, he might have something for those top three cars. It can take once again. Oh, look at Nick Trencher now trying to find some grip. Up to second over Zerbin. Here comes Gray Ferrando. Look at the V13 on the move. Boy, it's no surprise to see these three cars where they're running right now. Not at all. Ferrando going up top. Oh, three wide once again off turn two. Sixteen trying different lines seems to be working no matter where he goes. Trouble in the back, but they're able to keep her going. Another battle for right now, fourth is tight between the 81, 58, and last week's winner in the 14. Speaking of 14, 14 laps to go. That's not the way you want your night to go. Here we go back. Oh, Devin Reed makes a great move. Trying to get around Craig Moore, and he will. Here comes the B-13. Gray Ferrando. With plenty of laps remaining, nine to go at the line. Trying to get around Nick Trencher. Oh, there's a couple of hot dogs right there. Oh, he'll slide up. Trencher slides up. Oh, see if the B-13 can get him back. Great battle for second. Look at that. Once they slide by, it's hard to make it stick, though. Trencher back. What a battle for second place. Goodness gracious. 
First place, well, it's been that way all night for the 16 car, but I think Trenchard and Brando got their notes ready for tomorrow night. Coming around four, your winner in the race of champions, it's Colin Weinbarger, followed by Nick Trenchard, Gray Ferrando, Devin Reed, and Jeff Morris, top five. How about that, race fans? If you're leaving, drive safely. Thanks for coming out to Grays Harbor Raceway. We're